Good morning, Amici, and welcome back to another run vlog. It has been a long time since the last time we did one of these. The truth is, because boredom stole my shoes, man. Boredom stole my shoes. Moving here to Texas has been a challenge for running simply because it's flat and it's suburbia and it's boring and it's the same routes over and over with no real destinations to go and enjoy and explore and to bring you along with. So boredom stole my shoes. Now I still run at least two or three times a week. I still walk but I'm not doing anything exciting and I sure don't want to bring you along with that. But I got an idea. So I just got done completing the longest run I've done since I moved to Texas and it was six miles, 52 minutes. That's less than a nine minute mile, so feel pretty good about that. That is the longest I have ran since I've been here. And again, it all boils down to motivation. You know, when I first got into running, the first GPS watch I ever bought was the Nike Sports Watch. And I no longer have that watch because unfortunately the Nike Sports Watch didn't like water very much. So sweat destroyed it. I actually went through two of them and sweat destroyed both of them. Long story short, the Nike Sports Watch was cool because when you uploaded your run information, it would automatically populate different challenges that you signed up for. And I remember I signed up for a bunch of different challenges like first 10 mile run, uh, completing multiple 10 mile runs, getting under a certain time, but there was one challenge in particular that I entered myself into just for fun, and that was to run across the United States. I think I made it as far as Wyoming, from Washington State to Wyoming before the watch died, and I never got a chance to finish that. So. Here's what we're gonna do. This is my challenge to you, and this is a way that we're gonna continue the run vlog and just kinda have a conversation about it. So I'm originally born and raised in the state of Colorado, and that's what I'm gonna do. I am going to virtually run across the beautiful state of Colorado. You can come with me, or you can pick any destination you want. It could be a city, it could be a state, it could be a country. Wherever you are, you choose. Just figure out the distance from one side to the other, just as the crow flies type of distance, and that's what we're gonna do. Whether you're running, whether you're walking, whether you're just tracking your steps on a Fitbit, it doesn't matter. The point is that we're gonna go on this journey together, and how we get there, and the means and modes of which we do it, it's completely up to you. If you're not a runner and you're not a walker and you bicycle, do that. If you're disabled, track your distance somehow, man. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how you track it, but let's go on these journeys together. So for me, it's going to be the state of Colorado. And today marks day one of completing six miles from the western side of Colorado and we're gonna head east. We're gonna run into the sunrise. We run early in the morning and running into the sunrise is beautiful. So, so that's what we're gonna do. Every two weeks we'll check in. So I'll tell you what, in the comments down below, tell me what you're gonna commit to today. Where are you gonna run? What are you gonna run across? And what is your goal? And if you want to, how are you gonna do it? For me, it's a combination of running and walking in the mornings. And I'm gonna be tracking my miles on my Sunto Ambit and uh, yeah, enjoy this journey with me and let's do it together. So until next time, Amici, ciao a tutti and aloha. Bye-bye.